Hello guys, welcome back in another video tutorial of Odo 15 development. In this video tutorial, we will learn how to add configuration in PyCharm community for run Odo framework. Before start, I have to show you here, I created um, a repository on GitHub. You can download our modules code from here and uh, let's start. In last video, we create odoconf uh, file and uh, we give here some like uh, our db host port, user password, http port and add-ons path and this one our odo master password. Add-ons path, this one is uh, from odo which we created, these add-ons is uh, built in and this path under our main directory here is a custom modules this one we create this uh, directory we will uh, develop our modules inside this directory so now let's start first of all uh, in your pycharm uh, you have to uh, click here add configurations add new choose python give any name as you want i'm giving here odo dev 15.0 the script path inside our uh, odo directory here uh, bin odo bin this one i'll show you inside main directory means here we have the odo folder which we downloaded before inside this directory you can see odo bin just choose this uh, script path the parameters this file which we created odo dot uh, conf hyphen c means uh, configurations conf this folder uh, in our main directory conf inside conf we have odo dot conf and uh, python interpreter uh, it's uh, this one which we created before the virtual environment you can see here inside our main directive venv bin then python and uh, the working directory we have to choose our main directory that's it it's apply okay and run okay we get here an error uh, set limit memory hard okay just copy this one limit underscore memory underscore hard and pass zero save again run now it's working localhost then 8069 which port we defined here this one Actually, before I'm uh, working in another project, that's why it's showing this. Okay. With you, by default, it will show this page. And uh, here, the master password we have to give. In next video, I will explain all this. So, that's for this video. In another uh, video, I will show you how to uh, set up. And uh, then, we will start to create our modules.